Hi everyone, check out this awesome thing I've got here in my head. Isn't it really neat looking? Let me teach you how to get one for yourself. So this is actually part of a temporary event in Monster Hunter World. So you're going to want to get this as soon as possible, since it's only going to be around for a week. So to get started, you first need to have a hunter rank of at least 11. Next, you go to your quest board and select events. You're then going to want to select Wiggle Me This, which will make you deliver 10 wigglers. What are wigglers, you may be wondering? Wigglers are these little wiggly things that stick out of the ground in the coral highlands. You might have noticed them before. What you need to do is you need to capture 10 of them. In order to do this, you need to equip your net and throw it on them. But you may notice that when you try walking up to them, they hide in the ground. In order to get around this, you need to crouch and go up to them slowly, and once you're close enough, you can use your net. But don't get too close, as they'll still go into the ground if you get too close. Now the best way that I've found to do this is to go directly to your left as soon as you drop into the map, as there are three groups of them that you can keep switching in between to get this done rather quickly. Once you complete the event, you'll get a Wiggler ticket, and the amount that seems to drop is a little on the random side as I've received one, two, or even three sometimes. It's usually one though. Now you're going to need four of these tickets in order to get the headpiece. You're also going to need four Shamos hides, which you can find in the same area from these pink creatures. Simply go straight when you first get into the area and around this bend in order to find two groups of them right beside each other. It should only take you one run to get all the hides you need. Now along with that, you're going to need four Gauju scales which you get from these bony looking fish. I went over to Wildspire Waste for these as there's a spot where you can find two of them. The spot is over here to the right from your camp. I simply left after I took the two of them down and re-entered to get them a second time. Now the last item you need are coral bones, which you can find from bone piles in the coral highlands. You're gonna need three of these. So after you spend some time gathering all the materials needed for the armor, head on over to the smithy, select forge equipment and select armor. Then go all the way down under the high rank tab until you see a piece of armor called a wiggler head. Simply forge and then you'll be able to equip it. Now this piece of armor does have a pretty decent amount of defense and the perk in it is wide range which lets items affect nearby allies. So this can be pretty useful whether you're playing solo or if you decide to use it in multiplayer. Alrighty, that's all for this one. If it helped you out, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. I'm Wolfie and I'll see you out on the hunt.